Greetings all, it's the Devious Monkey here. It is another glorious Saturday morning. I guess falls here. It's 67 degrees. Last night, it almost got down into the 50s. So yes, definitely fall is here. And that's great because I'm digging the cooler temperatures, especially because I'm about to go out to Back Bay Wildlife Refuge to do some filming and hopefully get some awesome pictures. It's gonna be nicer this time because it's not 105 degrees. Last time I went there, which was the first time I went there, I didn't spend a lot of time because it literally was like over 100 degrees. I, I mean, I was practically heat stroked. It was un, unbearable. So I didn't spend any time there. And that's a shame because it's such an amazing place. So I'm gonna spend some time there today. So here we are, we're in uh, Back Bay Wildlife Refuge and already I'm not disappointed. Don't know if, if you can get close enough with this 20 millimeter, but, but basically right there, there's what looks to be like a great blue heron. Okay, so uh, pretty much gonna just figure that I've never been here before because I've never been anywhere up till like right over there where I saw that crane. It was so hot that I had to turn around and, and eat my way back to the truck and get in the AC. But it's gorgeous out here today and I just wanna show you the view from this stand. So it's amazing out here. I could definitely see bringing my bike out here and riding around. I'd have to change up how I carry all this gear, but uh, yeah, this is amazing. So I'm gonna head out and start walking around. I've been walking around for a while now, come across the same great blue heron. He's just sort of hanging out here in the reeds and I've already tried to twist this camera to point over that way. But with this 20 millimeter, it, it's like he's a mile away. He's really, meh. I don't know, 30 feet. I'll turn it anyways. He's right there. <laughs> and if you weren't paying attention, you'd drive right, or walk right by that uh, section there and not even see him standing there in the, in the reeds and the grass and all that kind of stuff. Pretty cool. He's just been sitting there for a little bit. I got a bunch of pictures of him. And there's a billion people coming by in bikes and doesn't fluster them at all, so that's pretty cool. But all right, I'm gonna get going. I'm walking along the Raptor Trail. Let's show you what that looks like. Now I've taken this both directions. This just goes out to, there's like a dock system that uh, is right along the water. This takes you further along that. But I mean, look at this stuff. Isn't this awesome? Just gorgeous. So peaceful and just listening to the wind. Well, here, I'll shut up so you can listen to the wind. How can that not like totally relax you? This is really hard to do between holding out the A7C to film and holding this birding setup with the A7R4. Holy shit, the shoulders are screaming. All right, kids, that was a lot of fun. Uh, that was also a shit ton of walking, but that was the whole point of going there. So I got some great blue heron action. Actually, some really good shots there because they were so close. And I, I don't know what the one, the, the very last thing that I shot was. Brown, brown heron, if there is such a thing, or just a juvenile, some other kind of heron, I'll have to look it up. Uh, I was walking behind two girls who were pointing all kinds of shit out. Uh, mostly spiders, but 
I couldn't get them because, you know, the 200 to 600, it was like right there. Uh, I did eventually play around with the settings and was able to uh, get pictures of a water moccasin. They said it was a water moccasin. Uh, I don't even know how the hell they saw it. It was completely blended in and in, a, in a, just a spot that, why were you even looking there? But they were, so I got the shot. I got some other birds that I haven't gotten before. That was very fun. So it's one o'clock. So basically I, I was out there for a good couple hours. If you're ever in, in, in this area, in the Virginia Beach area, I highly recommend you get your ass to Back Bay Wildlife Refuge and check it out because it's awesome. And you won't regret it. I know I didn't. For now, that's it. That's all I've got for you. As always, thank you for joining me. Be sure to like and subscribe. And remember kids, forward and up.